hi welcome to our youtube channel my name is dilip kumar today in this video let us talk about stem borer or trunk borer uh, this is a, a grapefruit uh, you know plant uh, this trunk uh, borer or you know stem borer uh, pest is uh, common in almost uh, all uh, types of uh, tree especially in this uh, tree citrus uh, types of uh, you know trees uh, this is the stem this is about one and a half year old uh, tree small uh, you know tree and uh, we can find you know this uh, uh, stem borer uh, where it is located very easily actually uh, see this is the in year year at one place it has uh, uh, dug up you know that uh, stem borer uh, got hit in the uh, trunk of this uh, tree this is uh, very common but uh, if you live in such a way uh, the tree it will uh, eventually uh, dry and it will uh, die that is how these are the uh, here uh, you can uh, focus here uh, you can find the excretion of uh, this uh, trunk uh, borer uh, can you uh, if uh, can you come from this side you can focus here there is a lot of uh, uh, the stem borer droppings or uh, the you know excretion part is there by seeing this you know droppings you can e easily uh, recognize this is a stem borer now i will uh, show you yes here I think from this side you can uh, focus much better. Very easily you can. Uh, the, these are the droppings of this uh, stem borer. Inside this there'll be uh, the one which is causing you know this heating, this stem. We can find. Say this is the stem borer. Here you can find. Here can you find it? it is uh, in very small size but it creates uh, very huge uh, you know damage i will try to oh, already i think i damaged it see this is the uh, stem borer or we call it uh, trunk borer this actually you have to you know remove it or uh, kill it and even it will uh, lay eggs on this uh, stem part those eggs actually we need to clean it i'll uh, explain how to do that this is uh, i'll uh, some more uh, stem borers i'll collect this is, uh, this is how it looks and uh, here in this part also we can find uh, this is very easy to you know uh, find these things here again it has gone inside here it made a hole see this is initially it will uh, bore horizontally and uh, after once it uh, enters into the inside the trunk it will uh, 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 you know uh, bore uh, vertically after that again in exit point again it will uh, uh, you know uh, do boring in uh, horizontally that is how it uh, uh, keeps on you know uh, uh, heating the trunk pot and the ang uh, ang uh, uh, you know the uh, stem borers will uh, uh, you know heat uh, you know the soft tissue at uh, uh, you know uh, top that is how these uh, lay uh, they, they consume the uh, you know uh, even sap of uh, this uh, tree this is actually we have to regularly uh, find and uh, we have to remove this uh, pest else the tree will uh, automatically uh, die after uh, some time here it has uh, made hole now what i do i fill these uh, holes uh, this is again one more hole you can uh, focus here a uh, while ago i just cleaned uh, here also i killed one uh, i cast one you know stem borer with this hole there will be some more stem borers inside this 
uh, for that either you can fill with uh, uh, any pesticide or uh, you can uh, spray uh, you know such as pesticides or uh, you can fill uh, kerosene or uh, petrol or diesel uh, and after uh, you know filling with uh, uh, these you know fuels like uh, petrol or uh, kerosene you need to uh, fill this wall with uh, wet clay uh, by thus you know uh, the tree will uh, again regrow on its uh, own that is how the maintenance part of uh, you know uh, of this uh, stem borer uh, come here one once again one more uh, stem borer as uh, is the uh, living here this is the this is the one this is very easy to find this uh, pest Usually they uh, live on these uh, trunks uh, and uh, twigs of these uh, things. You can find it has almost uh, consumed you know the uh, outer uh, part of this uh, stem. If you don't uh, notice this within 3-4 months you know the it will consume entire tree. Okay, here the stem borer, I am not able to see it, I think it is inside. Make sure you do not uh, damage the uh, stem part. So, we can uh, fill either uh, kerosene or uh, petrol. Come uh, here in another one more uh, tree about uh, uh, four months back, I noticed the same uh, you know pest uh, problem here also and the same way I uh, filled you know at that time here I filled a small powder uh, which we use for uh, cockroaches and uh, uh, you know ants that powder I used here in this part also the stem borer uh, consumed you know uh, outer part of this uh, skin of this you know chiku tree this is the chiku tree at that time I filled in such a same way and even in this uh, small chiku tree it consumed you know it damaged in about uh, 6 to 8 uh, places uh, this is one more uh, place and uh, this is another uh, place where uh, uh, that stem borer uh, damaged and uh, that is how I just uh, by filling uh, the white powder I uh, uh, just you know uh, I filled that white powder and uh, the powder which we use for uh, uh, kerosene uh, sorry uh, cockroaches so this is the powder uh, which we used which actually generally we use uh, most of the you know in rural houses people use this uh, powder for uh, uh, ants and uh, cockroaches this you need to fill in this way it's a little tricky but we can fill it and uh, after that make sure you fill uh, you know you cover this uh, whole part with uh, wet clay either you can uh, uh, spray or uh, fill kerosene also that is better actually putting kerosene but these days we are not finding uh, kerosene very rarely we keep kerosene and here again one more place uh, we need to fill that uh, I will fill the same way with uh, other places also in this tray this is how we can el eliminate uh, the stem borer or uh, trunk borer thank you uh, thank you so much for uh, watching our video if you like the video please hit the like button and also subscribe to our youtube channel thank you so much